in this quick video I will show you two different methods to export a frame from Premiere Pro. First, move your playhead to the place that you want to export. You could also use your arrows to move frame by frame and once you're happy with the frame that you want to export, click on this icon and click on show transport controls. Here you get this option to export frame and the shortcut key is control plus shift plus E. If you press that, it gives you an option to choose the name or you can leave it as default. You can change your format. You can also click here to import into project. If you're happy with the location, you can leave it as it is or you can browse for a the location. Then press OK and it has saved into my project folder. If I open it, you can see it is squashed. Okay. And that's because my aspect ratio of my footage is not quite correct. Obviously, if I import this squash image back to my Premium Pro, it would automatically get fixed. Or if I would import it to Photoshop, it would be fixed. But if you want to view it anywhere else, it would be squashed. That's why I will show you another way to export that it would not be squashed. So what you need to do, select again the frame you want to export, then go to file and click on export, click on media, which you can also access by pressing control M. Here you need to change your format to JPEG, for example, or PNG. We go with JPEG here. Then you can come here and change the quality of the video. And the most important thing here is that if export as a sequence is checked you should uncheck this if you would leave this export as sequence checked every frame would be exported as one still image and you would end up with a lot of a lot of images so this is very important to uncheck and also by default this might be checked and it might be hd and a four bit and that would cause it to be squashed again you need to change it to square pixels and the rest you can go through if you want to and then click on export and here it is file is exported and as you can see we got the black lines at the bottom and top image is not squashed and we exported it the way actually the image is